Back in the day, we had to use correction fluid. You may know it as liquid paper to fix our mistakes. But fortunately, you live in a time of computers. Desktop publishing is not just something that you print out on one machine or save on a big old floppy disk. Everything's in the cloud. So I want to do, believe it, this is a short one, um, three tricks, three tricks that you're going to love me for, no matter what computer program you're using. If this is for a keyboard class or a business class, uh, it's not just going to be for yearbook or newspaper or PR. Trust me. Now, first one you might be familiar with already, right? Uh, control A is going to select everything for you. Uh, okay. Uh, maybe I don't want everything selected, so I'm just going to select my text here. Okay. Control C copies it, right? Control X cuts it if you don't want to leave a copy. And then you might do this. You might right click and choose paste, or notice it says right there Control V. Now, half kids do that all the time. Control V. Watch what's going to happen. Assuming I didn't mess this up too bad. Are you not recording? Why'd that show up? Come on. <laughs> you want to show somebody something easy and fast. There you go. Control V. Yeah. Why? Okay. There you go. All right. What do you notice about this? Well, on the one hand, it's not blue. On the other hand, it's not um, the font style that my boss at my summer job likes all of our documents to be in. It's not even the right point size, right? So these are the three things that I want to help you with, okay? Well, listen carefully. Control Z, and I'll put these all in the bottom there. Uh, and Control Z is something you can use in any program. Almost every program recognizes it. So I hold down Control and Z. Yes, once oh, there, gone. Mistake is over, right? Uh, but there's another thing that you can use. So Control Z takes you back a step. It's pretty much the same as doing clicking these, right? Back buttons. Here's the next one, though. I don't know if you saw it when I right-clicked. Or if you're on a, 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 a Chromebook, you get two finger clip on your hickey there. See, this is paste without formatting, or Control plus Shift plus V instead of Control plus V. Now should be uh, I go up here. Maybe that's an edit, isn't it? Yeah, same thing show up down here, right? If I paste with a Control Shift V. In other words, <clears throat> come on now. There we go. I hold shift and control down before I hit V. Watch what it does. Pasting without formatting. Ba -bum. Instead of taking the formatting that you had in your other document, right? And maybe you take something that somebody emailed you and then you want to put it on Yearbook Avenue if you use Justin's or whatever other things that are out there, right? Isn't that great? Simplest thing in the world. So if you already knew Control A, Control C, Control V, I now give you Control Z and Control Shift V. Uh, but I also want to give you one more. This one, oh, I've been using computers since, right, like fifth or sixth grade old Apple IIEs. Uh, when I was on high school newspaper staff, we got some of the first uh, uh, Macintosh computers in 1985. <sighs> I started before InDesign, back when it was called, um, well, whatever it was called, it's not important, uh, and Photoshop for forever, right? I was last year, year old, I think, when somebody taught me this. Control F. Watch what will happen. Control F. See this? Little find. Find the document. Right? Or rather, find in the document. Okay? So here's what I want to find. I want to find another 
mistake. Ooh, I don't know if you noticed that. Fortunately, there's only one of one, but it highlighted it for me. If I were to type the whole thing in there, oh, it would highlight the whole thing for me. Okay. If I were someplace else in this document, and please don't look at any of the names because this is not your business, okay? But I click this down, and it's going to take me to where the mistake was. And I can take that out. Okay? Pretty useful. And if you hit the three dots, it gives you some more things like... You know, was it all caps? So, right? Also gives you a choice. A lot of people have found this in different computers. Sometimes teachers have taught them that, but all you got to do is control F and then you can do it. Right? Yeah, figures, three S's. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> right? If you wanted to, now, you could tell it to go ahead and replace all. So pretty useful. So again, Control-Z undoes stuff. Uh, Control-Shift-V is paste without formatting. And Control-F is find something. I hope that those were helpful for you. And I now am going to delete these because we don't need them anymore. But I still don't know how to turn this off. This has been the bullpen. And if I can figure out...